What is up? Brandon here. Now, if you're watching this video, you are already part of the team. So congratulations and welcome aboard. In this lesson sequence, in this uh, unit overview, I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step the way to build your machine to help us grow our business to the science of know, like, and trust. Now, I got this from uh, my buddy Jonathan over at Smart Shark. And this sequence is going to take us all the way from building a basic online presence to attracting the customers that are going to be our best fit as clients eventually. So this is a very organic way to take what we traditionally do as trainers and fitness professionals into the online space. Now, normally we attract clients through networking, right? So our clients will refer us or we um, engage with organizations that have our potential clients in it. This is absolutely no different, but we're just transitioning this to the digital space. So here's how it's going to work. Normally, you would, uh, your friends and family, they would know that you're a trainer or a fitness professional. And when someone in their circles, like, ah, I put on some weight, I got to, you know, find a trainer or something, they're like, aha, I know a trainer and they connect you, right? Now, this is that exact system, but in the digital sense, and here's how it's going to work. We're going to create your online avatar that authentically represents who you are and what you're about not only the fitness side of you, but the other side, because people don't just want to see you as a trainer. They want to connect to you on a deeper level. You know, what are your hobbies? What interests do you have in common? You know, do you have a favorite sports team? Do you like to go hiking? Do you like books? You know, are you into a particular type of music? Those are the things that are going to connect you because at the end of the day, it comes down to one thing. People are going to work with people they know, like, and trust, especially in this hyper-competitive market where there's tons of influencers with their shirt off and gimmicks everywhere. Trust is essential. So they're only going to work with us if they know, like, and trust us. So we have to be authentic in the way that we present ourselves. This starts with creating a profile online that shows our authentic self and gives people information about us. So we're going to walk through building a uh, Facebook profile that's going to show who you truly are and the things that you're interested in, as well as what you do professionally and the services that you offer. From there, we're going to work on building that network, right? If you only have like, two or three friends in your network, that's only two or three potential clients. But if you expand that to hundreds or even like Facebook allows 5,000 people, chances are you're gonna start to encounter people that are looking for your services. So our first goal is one, to build your online presence and your genuine avatar. Second one is to expand that friend list into the people that we wanna work with, right? We wanna find our clients or potential clients, the people that fit into our niche which we'll go over. And then we want to start to request them as friends. So we build that group. Then we want to let them know what we're about and what we do. So we need to be frequently posting not only fitness related things, but also things that show our true identity and interest so they can build that know, like, and trust with us. So if I'm a huge ACDC fan, I should probably be posting things about ACDC because it's something I like. There's going to be someone out there that's a potential client that's also an ACDC fan. They're going to be like, hey, that's somebody that I can connect with and I want to work with. So throughout this lesson, I want you to think about building know, like, and trust. This is a digital form of networking that we've used before. We are going to build your avatar profile. We're going to increase your friends. We're going to go to the places where we find those friends and interact in those groups. We're going to post regularly. And then we're going to direct people to our group where we can add value and share our fitness knowledge with them and then give them the option to become our client in the future if they feel that are valuable enough. So the funnel overview is build your profile, find groups where potential clients with your interests and our, that need our services, interact in those groups, find our targeted friends that we want to interact with and put into our network, request them, build the network, show them ourselves with the post, invite them into our fitness circle with our uh, entryway fitness or entry top funnel Facebook group, and then offer our services and let them to make the decision to come to us. So we have a better conversation now that they know, like, and trust us, and we can really help them down the line. So as you go through this course, make sure that you complete each lesson watching the video, completing the activity, and then do the accountability action with the activity. Make sure you're scheduling your weekly calls with me or whoever, whomever is training you throughout this process to check in and always, always, always ask every single question that pops into your mind. All right, I know you're gonna get do great, so let's get started.